Good day everyone and welcome back to Box on a Lawn. The challenge where you have to live in a box on a lawn. No really, this is the Rosebud Challenge by Euphorial Queen. They call me Dave and this is Rose RGB, my sim for this challenge. And when we last left off, she had just acquired her sister, Gwen RGB. Glenn, Gwen is uh, moved into a new upstairs room that I crafted for her. She has to pay her dues just like her older sister and uh, as such she has the camping bed, the camping light. She has her own portable shower and her own Chillville portable cooler. Once Rose shows her where all the digs are Gwen can begin earning simoleons herself and uh, then we will uh, gradually upgrade her room as, uh, as funds become available. Checking our achievements panel here, I see that the RGB household is now up to 29,678 simoleons towards the million simoleon goal. They both have quite a long way to go. Rose is off today and uh, her daily task to work out has not started. However, uh, she has reached <laughs> level 5 at least of the rocket of the uh, logic skill and she needs to reach level 6 of the fitness skill. So uh, doing her daily task will help with that endeavor. Also for her nerd brain aspiration uh, she has achieved level 5 of the handiness skill. She does own a rocket ship and she needs to launch or upgrade a rocket five times which she's launched a rocket once and upgraded a rocket once so that counts as two and uh, we'll need to fly another mission with Rose here soon. Gwen is also off today and uh, her daily task of homework is complete and she has gotten one skill to level two she is currently a high school C student because uh, she spent a week not doing her homework living at the observatory while I tried to figure out how to bring her into the household. She also has the nerd brain aspiration and currently she needs to finish three books. She has not finished a single book and she needs to achieve level three of the logic skill which she has achieved level one so we'll need to be working on her skills. Huh. Baby, not door. Huh? Ibna! Ha ha! Waba hai, so chips. Yumfo, Thernoi, Nuladis, Yikla, Arogba. Walla K, Erishup. Emuye, Puniqua. Adunda, Walla K, Erishup, Nuya. A pleva zaffle, Habiri Shirsha. Lunasig, Finaya Wallake, Nibahana Zarkini, Yasinarp. Ha! 
and this is the live pink whale. Yes, we still have a live pink whale. It has nothing to do with the challenge, but we have it. And it looks like Rose's friend here, Zoe Patel, has come by for another visit. Um, I think Rose has slept enough. It's almost uh, 1130. So we'll go ahead and uh, invite Zoe in. Wadida Kanchu? Yala Nim? Eh, Aflin. Rose is getting pretty hungry. So, um... Uh, uh, yeah. Naba! Naba, indeed. Naya. Uh -huh. Go ahead and uh, grab a serving there, Rose. Meanwhile, Gwen is upstairs. Uh, we're going to let her sleep and charge her energy up as much as possible. However, she will be coming down for a nice pee here soon. Okay, Zoe is once again fascinated by Rose's collection of Easter eggs. Galpa Longi. Uh-huh. Awavine. Floopy. Balafoy Camus Awavine Vina Garza Fwib Bean Koya <laughs> Pardu Skitna Washes a breeze Zoe Water is focused Jareeb. All Rami Sims who enter this room are focused Damse Brihana Damse Brihana indeed Girabu Balsh Kiara Balansif, Spavin, Lerna Pafinskuma, Snubara, Dupna Timpi, Watimini Chalk, Flasha <laughs> Zabris, Baribi Damse, Shamagra, Sablur Faroda, Bruhana. Zoe <laughs> sure can't talk, can't she? Barib Finalibo. Okay, Rose. Oh, yes, I keep forgetting. I do need to get them a real kitchen sink here at some point. Okay. Go ahead and bladder there, Rose. And then you need to clean your bathtub because it, it is filthy. <laughs> Looks like Zoe wants to go play on the computer. How is Gwen doing? Uh, Gwen's not quite done. Who is at the door now? Ah, the directorate is here. Well, let's invite the directorate in. So, the directorate here is, in fact, my sim self, dressed up in sciencey, fictiony looking clothing. And uh, really, I just had him there as a placeholder so that I could put Gwen in the world as a teen, because you cannot place a teen by themselves into a household. Now, um, I almost, I'm not intending to bring my sim self into the household. Uh, I'm just going to let him be a NPC in the world. And uh, I'm almost tempted to go back into his household and cheat his careers and his skills up since I'm not planning to use him in this actual play. He's just going to be there. Um, let's go ahead and have uh, Gwen come down here when she's done sleeping, I guess. All right, so Rose does need to reach fitness level 6. She is at fitness level 5, 24% complete. She also needs to launch or upgrade a rocket five times. Except until then, Rose is going to read Orbital Pudding, nonfiction, by Zachary Quinn. A mountain-sized glob of coconut pudding is lobbed into orbit to study its potential for sustaining life on other planets. 
Meanwhile, Gwen is quietly sleeping away up here. Uh, I think she's slept long enough and she's about to really need to pee here. So let's go ahead and have her get up. She's also starting to get very hungry. So Gwen is a genetic twin of uh, Rose RGB. Itagom DeRoy Uniyape. Ah, Directorate must be trolling to forums. I know that laugh anywhere. Basamu, Penerf. Aha. And Gwen can uh, satisfy her hunger here. Gwen is also going to grab a serving. Now Rose got this mission control panel last time, and I I think you can just use it as a desk. It has a confident aura, um, but I haven't tried putting a chair in front of it yet, so I don't know exactly what the deal is, other than it has blinking lights. Proud. Here's Rose and Gwen. Rose is studying a book because she's a bookworm, and Gwen is eating because she's hungry. And dag dag. Zoe Patel needs to get home. So let's see, what do we need to do here? I need to have. Um, Rose is almost finished with analyzing this book. Um, she does like to analyze books, being a bookworm. <laughs> so Gwen is not so much a clone per se as a twin, because I actually did use the play with genetics tool in CAS when I originally made Rose. Uh, Gwen is a twin created from Rose, so uh, let's go ahead and have Rose take a shower. And Gwen, you need to learn how to clean up your dirty dishes. Uh, Sorrowful? Sorrowful? Uh, a beamy. A beamy indeed. Oh, because Rose is in there, she can't use the sink. Okay, well that's neat. I guess we really will have to get them some sort of uh, kitchen appliance here. Uh huh. <laughs> Yibs. Yibs indeed. Sim me. Okay, Gwen wants to read Crisis no! Barn here. However, she needs to achieve. Well, let's see. She does need to finish three books. Let's let's let her read. Uh, I guess that works out fine. Uh, however, Gwen is quite the gamer, and where are you going, Gwen? That was strange. Uh, Gwen is quite the gamer, and she wants to go practice writing. I thought for sure she was going to play a game. So Rose is going to put the book away. Okay, Gwen, clean up your dish. Gwen has acquired the writing skill. Gwen's newly acquired writing skill will allow her to enjoy the benefits of an expanded vocabulary and grammatically correct sentences. Gwen Archibi. The tour will preserve. Oh, but toy Skiba. <laughs> okay, Gwen, why don't you play with Dar here, and Rose, why don't you craft furniture, mirror, garden, bar, bar, so we still don't just have desk chairs. Let's, let's craft another end table. We need another end table. And she needs to get her handiness <laughs> skill up. Ready. Oh, what? okay, that's right. I turned these lights off. Uh -huh. Menard 
Okay, Gwen has reached logic level 2. Gwen can now collect plant samples and analyze them under a microscope. She can also discuss logic with other sims, Gwen RGB. <laughs> Gwen just got a text. So Gwen is working on her logic skill. She's barely into level two, but uh, let's see, she needs to get to level three. We'll let her play chess here for a little bit. Well, it looks like Dar is tired and he's going to go home. And uh, Gwen now has nothing left to do. Lenard. Lenard, indeed. Uh, continue to play chess, Gwen, since you're focused and stuff. Uh, Gwen needs some hygiene. Okay. Uh, let's actually have Gwen queue up a shower. And uh, the table that Rose just crafted is in here. And it is an excellent quality table made by Rose Archibald. An end table is a bit like a bar stool, except that woodworking mistakes are plainer to see. Get it? It's valued at 210 simoleons. However, we're not going to sell it. We're going to use it. Let's stick that there. Let's stick this here. And we're going to put the light. The light doesn't go on the end table? Is this strictly a floor light? I guess it's strictly a floor light. Interesting. Um, maybe we will sell the end table. Do I need a table end table for anything else? Let's just sell the end table. Rose can always craft another one. That's 210 simoleons. We're going to put the light back over here on the floor. Okay, let's see here. What else can... No, that's... We need rows to craft furniture. A mirror, a garden pot, garden planter, end table, bar stool, wall shelf, wall hanging. Hmm. I really wish Rose could craft a desk or some chairs. We don't have chairs yet. Uh, what is Rose's skill level in handiness? She is almost, she is 80% complete with level 5. Well, let's have her craft a, um, I don't think the sculptures increase your handiness as much as the furniture. So... Let's craft more furniture. In fact, I don't know what I want to craft. Let's craft a bar stool. Oh, Lemita. Oh. Okay, now Rose is going to need to... Rose is off tomorrow. Okay, so we have plenty of time to get her daily workout task in. Um, what is her fitness skill? She is only 24% complete with level 5. So Rose is going to need to work out some more. Let's let Gwen go ahead and take that shower. Oh. 
soon as I get enough simoleons here to, to, to be able to work with and move stuff around, I'm going to Leonard. going to redesign their house a little bit. I think what I need to do is I, I need to slide this breakfast nook out towards the street some more and I need to expand the kitchen. In fact, the way it sits right now Let's go ahead and do the kitchen. Let's expand out one more block. Let's clone another piece of counter here. And let's get... Let's get Rose a real kitchen sink for once. So we can afford a 275 simoleon last resort sink. It comes in various colors. Let me decide what color. Let's just go with that. There we are. So now they have a real kitchen sink. Let me make sure all of my uh, wall. T ah, missing a wall texture here. Okay, and that wasn't too expensive. We still have 1,907 simoleons in the bank. But I won't do any more major renovations until uh, next time. Okay, it appears... Oh. <laughs> Rose has finished the uh, bar stool. Quality excellent. Bar stool made by Rose Archibi. A bar stool is one of the simpler pieces of furniture that can be crafted with a woodworking table. Value, 60 simoleons. However, it has achieved comfort level 5. I think we'll give the bar stool to Gwen. She uh, really doesn't have any place to use it right now, but... Um, yeah. We'll, uh, it might come in handy later, so uh, I'm, it's only 60 simoleons. I'm not going to sell it just yet. Okay, what we're going to have Rose do is go jogging because uh, she needs to. And that will uh, finish her daily task and that will uh, get her closer to reaching level 6 of the fitness skill. So Rose can go jogging here. Meanwhile, back at Gwen, okay, Gwen is going to troll to forums. Do not troll to forums, Gwen. Gwen, you need to finish reading three books. So, what we're going to do is, uh, let's see if there's a logic book here. Dark, Lord of the whatever, First Unicorn, Crisis Barn, Penny Pizza. We do not have any skill books. Orbital Pudding, The Gluten Spiel. Okay, it looks like we're going to have to purchase a book. Skills. Logic Volume 1, an introduction. Let's go ahead and buy that. 75 simoleons. And Gwen, read Logic Volume 1. Meanwhile, Rose is still jogging. That's good. Okay, so now we're going to kill two birds with one stone, as they say. Gwen is going to uh, be increasing her logic skill while finishing a book. Neat how that works. So we're going to let Gwen do that. Where's Ro Rose? Rose has only achieved 25% of her daily task. So let's go jogging some more. It is now 8.45 p.m. sim time. I'm 
going to just follow Rose around as she jogs. We're going to see a uh, trash epidemic again. We have random sims carrying trash everywhere. Okay, let me look at Rose's stats. Okay, she will. She's getting low on energy and uh, she's going to need to pee before too much longer. And her skill, fitness level 32% complete with level 5. I don't really know why she doesn't just jog around the entire neighborhood in a big circuit, but uh, oh well, no matter. As Rose passes by this area here, let's, yes, keep jogging, keep jogging. There should be... Oh, there's a dig. Let's go ahead and get that dig, Rose, while we're out here. And Gwen is still reading. Uh, her logic skill is 65% complete with level 2. She needs to get to level 3. And we can dig this. Okay. Oh. Meanwhile, it's time to breed frogs. Because it wouldn't be an episode of Box on the Lawn if I didn't forget to breed frogs. Ooh. And... Luray? Luray, indeed. She uh. got Death Metal and a Shinolite. Let's continue to go jogging, push the limits. Now she is 50% done with her daily task. Gwen has now decided to chat on the computer. So I take it Gwen has not uh, finished her um, logical endeavor here. She did not achieve level 3, and uh, apparently she did not finish reading a book. And here we are with the trash epidemic again. Okay, let's look at Rose. And 75% done with her daily task. All right. Gwen's back at the house having herself a drink of fortifying milk. <laughs> Come on, Rose. Okay. That's it, Rose. We can go home now. Now, Rose is starting to get pretty tired, and I think we should, um, yeah, she, she goes to work at 6 a.m. on Monday, so we need to get her on a schedule where she, uh, she can start um, going to bed, hopefully early. What? What is, oh. The refrigerator has broken. Okay. All right, Rose. I uh, I know you're tired. So let's ask the uh, cube about scientific mysteries. Uh, <gasps> oh, nay. <laughs> nay, indeed. The mysteries in the universe will remain hidden. Uh, why don't you uh, put that in your inventory there, Rose? Thank you. Uh, oh, I know what we need to have Rose do. Um, view focused work, Rose. We need to get you focused. And Gwen is uncomfortable. because of all the filthiness. Let's have Gwen mop also. Gwen needs to earn her keep. Rose is now focused. Repair the fridge, Rose. Uh, this should go okay. Rose has got a f relatively high 
skill level and handiness. And Rose obtained the following upgrade parts. One kitchen upgrade part. So where did it throw? Okay. Rose, you need to come out here and scavenge this for parts. Last thing we need is a trash plant growing out here. And uh, let's go ahead and have Gwen use the potty. Okay, throw that away, Rose. Now, I don't think Gwen has any handiness skill at all yet, so uh, she, uh, she does not need to be repairing electronical things right now. And Gwen's going to go hug her sister. Yes, let's let that happen. Okay, it looks like Rose is tired and is going to hit the sack. And uh, Gwen. Gwen doesn't, you don't need to chat with your sister. She's gone to sleep. Um, Rose, why don't you... Rose needs to take a bath. So let's have Rose take a bath and uh, Gwen is actually going to put the logic book away. Sitting down and getting up. Sitting down and getting up. Ah! The floor beast is swipey. <laughs> uh, let's just go ahead and have a quick meal of some uh, cereal because Gwen is getting hungry and it's, I'm fixing to send her to bed here soon. So today was kind of like a no plan day but I still got them to accomplish some things. We didn't go out. We didn't go to space. Uh, I think I'm going to try to, to send Rose on a space mission tomorrow because Rose is off tomorrow as well. In fact, while Rose is at it, is there anything in here? Uh, mac and cheese, one left. Okay, Rose can eat that when she's done taking a shower. Hmm. And then when she's done with that, she can sleep. Gwen needs to, uh, well, clean up and go to sleep, I guess. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and send Gwen to bed so she can get rest and uh, charge herself up for tomorrow because she, um, she still has books to read and logic to achieve. And Gwen is off to bed. Back to Rose. Rose is going to eat her mac and cheese and then hit the sack. Okay, so I need to start thinking about upgrading. I haven't, this is still the original bed that Rose bought when she first had enough money to buy a halfway decent bed. But since it's only halfway decent, I need to get one that's decent. So I think, let's see, we've got 1,992 simoleons. And it is time to breed frogs again, of all things. Wow. Rose has bred a new frog, Rose Archie. 160 simoleons. So at some point here Rose is going to have to go out and find find uh, Rose is going to have to basically take Gwen on a crystal hunting tour and uh, show her the ropes. Rose is going to have to show Gwen how to pill food and uh, even though they've got a stable home here, they don't necessarily need to pill food. Food pilfing is an RGB trait, and uh, Rose must.
must teach her sister Gwen how to use it. So we're going to a fossilized alien skull. I would rather not just the novelty of that. I'm going to Oh, I could have kept that end table and used it to store the fossilized alien skull. Rose needs more house. And we have a pre 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 sim head which is also very valuable. We're going to have her keep these crystals because I do want to build her an exercise room. And uh, she has death metal rarity uncommon. And she has a kitchen upgrade part. Okay, so maybe tomorrow I'll have her upgrade something and then fly a rocket. And um, and then for Gwen, we'll have Gwen try to find some digs, at least the close by ones. In fact, yes, digs have spawned. Digs have spawned right here and right here. Well, that's about it for this day. It's already 4.20 a.m. And um, that's about all I can do for right now. So until next time... I guess we'll say goodbye for now.